Hello, kids. Steve, come back at you on a rather warm Wednesday. I'm hot, I'm sweaty, and it's about 80 degrees out here in Kansas. Today, let's have a very unique and interesting Mail Day Wednesday. Three packages here, one from Wisconsin, one from Florida, and this one all the way from Greenfield, Indiana. There I am. And let's see what we get. I know two of them are eBay purchases. One of them is from my brother. You'll get a kick out of his. Even the return address is pretty good. I got one big box from Florida, which is odd. Because I believe the one I'm opening is two individual cards. And it's not. It's two individual packs. Which is fine. Because I ordered some non-sport packs. There's only one in here. I wonder where the other one is. I will have to contact the seller to see where my Elvis pack is. This one here is from, I believe, the UK. From Denmark, actually. As you can tell, it's from the Monty Gum Card. Look at all the different languages on there. And this is TV Hits. Looks like we have Flipper. We have Grasshopper. David Carradine. Rest in peace. And we have Zorro. Grasshopper was the Kung Fu. If you remember that show at all. Did not have one of these. It's from the 70s as you can tell. And I like it. Plus I like these Monty Gum packs they are nothing but paper that are sealed and the piece of gum in here is going to be all about that big round and that thick so these are pretty cool let's get into this florida one i am very interested in seeing what's in here especially since that first one is not what i thought it was but hey that happens I do hope everyone else had a great Wednesday out there, you know. It is very cool. Oh, okay. I know what this is. I do believe Big D's Sports and Collectibles is behind this. It is not what I thought. I really have to check eBay because I should have gotten two autograph cards that are listed as delivered. And two non-sport packs listed as delivered. And I only got one non-sport pack. But this is really cool. How a guy in Florida got this, I don't know. But it's from the Milwaukee Brewers Team Store. Brought to you by Clements. It's a bobblehead. And it's Paul Molitor, number four. That is really cool. That is super awesome. It arrived safe, D. That's cool. Box is a great shape. That'll make a great addition to my bobblehead collection up in my second bedroom. Now, let's get into this one for my brother. It came to Steve Arino L. Rodemacher. Not sure what the L is for, but it came from Bo Ner. So let's see what I get from Boner. Ought to be interesting, as it always is. I know I had him pick me up a few cards. If you watch Takeover Tuesday at one of the card shops in Baraboo, Wisconsin, that he went to, I was not really interested in anything from the anime convention. That was very interesting and a fun walkthrough. Just not my regular cup of tea. I know it is his with black pink and all that kind of stuff. So that's, that's nice. He may have picked me up a few odds and ends there, but we shall find out together. All right. Very nicely packed, my brother. Thank you. Okay, yep. So here's a couple of things that I ordered or told him to purchase. And I can now open some unpack. We got the WWE Heritage Trading Cards 2021. Those are really well done. Okay. 
I got written in Japanese. Whatever this is, that's really cool. Don't have one going right to my PC. There's some of the other WWE cards. These are the 2021 WWE. The base or regular trading cards. Got a receipt. That's always pretty good. Even though I already paid him. All right, we got a few more real monsters. Oh, more crow. Good. Can't wait to open those on Saturday morning cartoons. Fire engines and Hollywood pinups. Very, very nice job. Thank you so much for that. Now, let's get into the singles he sent me. See what they are. Oh, these look like old dinosaur tacks from the 80s, and they are. We have Coasting to Calamity. Do not want to be on that roller coaster. The Behemoth Fries. I think someone sold that to him off eBay. Kind of backhandedly, they advertised them as Godzilla cards. Alrighty. Oh, wow. Very cool. These two are real Pokemon cards that he picked up at the aforementioned show because I'm into monkeys a lot. And I got um, Loud Howl and Flare. That's cool. Thank you, John. <laughs> and two that he customized. We have an Aaron Rodgers Pokemon card that I will read to you. Ability, Touchdown. The defending Pokemon is now paralyzed and confused. They must be bears. Throw on the run. Flip a coin. If heads, this attack does 60 damage plus an additional 20. If tails, this attack does 60 damage. Look at that. I don't know what any of the numbers down there or up there mean. But what I do know is that number in the upper right is more than my buddy origami folder my brother made a customized pokemon of him i hope you watched his video with him and his daughter opening package for my brother there's a lot of other customized cards including other pokemon this one just just made him smile made me happy to see him so tickled pink for this there he is, origami folder. And we shall read here. His special ability, helping friends. Search your discard pile for up to two Pokemon. Reveal them and put them into your hand. Hiding geocache, your opponent's active Pokemon is now confused. So that that's awesome, John. Good job on that. That's, <laughs> they feel exactly like originals i mean same thickness same size same everything including all the way down to the backs if you hold them like this you can't even tell which one's which so that's really super appreciate you brother appreciate you dave i'm glad you enjoyed this package as much as you did and to everyone out there i just want to remind you to be excellent to Everybody always treat others the way you want to be treated. Live life to the fullest, and above all else, peace.